day ladies and gentlemen you are welcome here today to this video tutorial today in this video tutorial uh, we are going to be designing this simple uh, but amazing uh, food flyer right so make sure you follow the video tutorial carefully because um, today we are going to be learning something new here especially when it comes to um, shape modification make sure you follow carefully so that at the end of the day we are all going to arrive at the same thing and also please and please um, kindly support us by subscribing to this channel and also liking the videos uh, and also turn on the notification bell to be notified whenever we drop such amazing content thank you very much now let's start from scratch all right so the first thing we are going to be doing here is um the image size i guess in that so you come to this background um double layer panel here then you come to image size you see that you come to image size so we are going to change the the, the height so the width remains 1280 but then the height we are going to change it to 1480 so we are going to change this to four you get that then you click on ok so when you are done um you delete this text here the next thing is let's give the background a white color so you give the background a white color now after this now when you look at the, the design carefully you see that there's this particular um, strips on the um, background so what we do is that you come to um, the background editor come to, sorry I mean come to the character editor then you click on import so I click on import we are going to import that particular um, white background shape so this is it here so when you click on it this way you click on this ratio one is to one or better still let let's not use one is to one let's use um six is to eight the last one here because we have changed the the um the resolution of the flyer from the normal one is to one to this section so you just click six to six is to eight this way then you increase the size like this to fill up the entire um background like this and the next thing you do is you come to um opacity here then you reduce the opacity reduce it to at least 30 yeah 30 is okay but you can still reduce it further yeah but let's leave it at 30 so after that you come to the layer panel then you lock it up this section then you lock it up right so the next thing is the the shape just like i said so you come to um the character editor then you come to shapes now i click on the shape uh give it a radius first that's the first thing to do so you give it a radius of about 15 now um, let's scroll down here and go to color let's color this fill color section here so you check the color side um, scroll and you see this color here so we are going to be using that color so you just scroll through your colors you see this particular color there I think this is deep orange yeah deep orange yeah so that is that so you select that color now after you are done selecting the color you click on the tick mark then now this is the new thing you are going to be learning here you see this particular um icon here we call perspective right so make sure you come to perspective then you turn it on now when you after you are done enabling it you hold here and stretch it up like this hold here and stretch it down like this then click on the tick mark this is the shape you are going to get here are you seeing that so uh make sure you watch the video tutorial carefully and then um you do um something amazing like this right so that is the first thing so when you're done you position it there like this so the next thing is to import that of the um i mean that of the the beggar so you um click on imports then you select it here now um, just like I said, I'm going to be leaving uh, a link 
in the description which will lead you to where you can access all these um, resources so check within the description for that right so that's what you're going to do so you bring this here and we are almost done with the flyer you get that so the next thing is just to add your text and then we are done with that so let's add other um i mean other resources like um the leaf and then that of this sliced um tomato so you come to that and then you bring it here so just reduce the size and place it here yeah sure so the next thing is to add um the other one which is this one so with this we are just going to move it to the back here like this yeah yeah sure that is it so let's continue the next thing is to come to shapes so you come to shapes then you reduce the size of the shape like this reduce it like this so then you give the um, shape a radius then also give it the same color of that of um, the, the 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 shape a bit so just come to your color section then you check through that same color then you you choose that one so you can choose that one here make sure you follow carefully so then you click on the tick mark now when you click on the tick mark uh, the next thing is to click on this copy button copy it then you bring it here now um, sometimes uh, when you are placing this one here make sure that it is in line with the other one so sometimes you use this um, here this lines here to check alignment so just come and click on it when you click on it then you can activate this particular um, bars here by using this one so when you click on this one you see that you can be able to move this um, lines here so you got, you are going to move it down here to check whether everything the two of them is in line are you are, are you okay with what i'm saying right so that's what you're going to do so when you're done you just click on it again to go to disappear now um one thing i did here was to move this to the back so that we have that same strip that is on the background also appear on those text so you click on it come and click on it this way then you come to click on to back you see that this this icon you see that it will be moved to the back having this strip shape on it the same as this click on it then you click to back all right um next please guys don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also like our videos for more amazing content right so the next thing we are going to be doing is to add that of um um the call icon and also lo uh, the location icon right so let's add those ones here so call icon and then location icon now um we can choose to leave this call icon at black color so let's just leave it's like that so place it here then we import the um, location icon let's import the location icon now this is the location icon and we are going to change that one to to black so let's change it to black color then we place that one to here now we are almost done with our flyer the only thing is to um, just be working on text adding text adding text that is the only thing that is left right so without wasting my time let's just start adding the text right from here so you come and click come to the text editor then you click on this plus sign here now we are done click on the plus sign bring it here then you edit it to let's first of all let's write order now order now order now so when you click on order now sorry when you type order now order now we are done typing uh, you just bring it to this section here where we are going to give it a white color a white color 
Now, after you are done giving it to white color, you come to your font. Come to font. We are going to give it a font. And the name of the font is um, this. This particular font here. This font here. So you click on this. And then you click on um, OK. So I click on OK. This is what you are going to see. Order now. Right. So the next thing is we, we kept an emphasis on it by adding this um, circular stuff to it. So you let's import that here. By referring to this one here. So you just um, bring it here. You see that here. So that is um, what you are going to do at this section. Now the next thing is to add another text. Um, spicy burger. So just edit here. Spicy burger. Spicy. So first of all, let's write spicy. Then we um, give it a color i don't know either we can use white or you can use yellow any of them you use is uh is okay because the color will blend well either yellow or use white are you okay so any of them that you want to use you can go with that so after that you come to font come to font then we give it a font known as abro fat face regular I'm referring to this particular one here. Ebro fat face regular. Click on OK. Then after that, you click on the spicy and then you click on copy. So when you click on copy, you bring it uh, below the spicy, then you write um, burger. Burger. So with the burger, I'm changing the color to white. But you can also leave your own to, um, you can leave your own yellow or anything at all. Just, yeah. Now after that, we're going to add just some small text, like as in sometimes slogan, or some people would say their motto. So let me just write anything like, um, I'm so delicious. And tasty just anything at all anything at all is okay so you just write that one then you use the size place it here under the um burger i mean the text then you give it a white color then you come to font then you give it a font known as circle godita this way right you see the reason why I said you should always um, lock your lock your um, I mean your resources so that you don't get distracted when you are designing. All right. So that is it. So after that you can lock everything up because I've not been able to lock my work out so that. So make sure you lock everything up. Please kindly support us by subscribing to our channel and also um, like our videos. And make sure you turn on your notification video, uh, your notification bell to be notified whenever we drop such amazing um, videos. Right, so the next thing is to um, add our location and also the call. So with the location, I'm going to, we are going to be using the same font as the one we use for this description here. So you just click on it and then you click on copy. So when you click on copy, you bring it down here. So you write your location. So I'm just going to use any of these locations please i'm going to use a cramor so you can also use any location at all you want that's what i want to use here for this de uh, design a cramor then you can click on it and then you copy it then you bring that one to here then you add your your contact info so let's write plus two three three two zero two six seven two nine Seven. Please, no one should come and call me asking me that you want to order burger. There was a time I made a particular video on um, uh, pizza, pizza design. Check through the videos, you see that particular video where people were calling me. You are calling me on my number that you want to order pizza. Hey, please, it's just for the sake of designing. I'm not into um, selling of this stuff, so that is it. 
right so um this one too you can also check your alignment for the text and then uh, for the location and that of the um the um the contact because as a graphic designer you need to be checking alignment to make sure that everything is in line are you okay so we are going to click on this particular one uh, again then we click on this here to activate the lines then we hold one of them and then bring it to the section of the text and make sure that everything is in line you can see that they are not in line so we click on the Accra mall and then make sure it come on the line right just as this so that is it for this particular design. when you are done then you can save your design as usual just click on this here to save your design right thank you very much for watching this video this was brought to you by dewpoint and sponsored by dewpoint graphics academy please do well to subscribe to our channel and like the video for more thank you very much see you in the next video